Hi guys, I'm <laughs> Elena. And we're watching Vikings. Last so one. The best, finally, the best laid plans. We're finally here. Very excited to watch it, to find out what's going to happen. We literally just talked about I the actually, last episode and the, the five minutes ago. So I, <laughs> Yeah, and I actually don't think... I don't think something huge is going to happen in this episode. I think well, there's no just, way there's yeah, gonna be the war with us. Yeah, it's one episode, and I think it's kind of just gonna be a bit I think, preparation for the yeah. I think final it's gonna season. be. I think it's potentially gonna be the. I don't know confrontation, maybe not, um, between Bjorn and Harold because I don't know if Bjorn is gonna agree to uh, leave Kattegat yeah, defenseless and go protect the capital because that would mean that he has agreed that Harold is king of all Norway and all that and. Um, don't think he's gonna do that so yeah but at the same time if he just stays in Kattegat and brass at that Kattegat he's just gonna no uh, exactly destroyed. exactly so, like, what's the good plan here uh to convince king harold that don't be a fucking bitch let's resolve the issues with the Russ, and then we'll we'll, we'll resolve our issues let's go let's just get together now but i think harold wants to kill two flies with one stone is that the saying in english i don't know and have bjorn bow down to him and also defeat the Russ. i feel like that might be what this episode is gonna be and also maybe something maybe we'll see floki if we don't see floki a uh, floki is fucking dead yeah I think oh, if we don't see, see floki him, here i think we will i think we're gonna see him maybe by the end of the next season imagine he was like all this time he was dead or I wouldn't God. be shocked because like or he, uh, the mountain did fall on him, but like there has to be something more there. Probably he became a god. <laughs> yeah, probably that. He became. A remember god. he when he became a, a, a seer. seer so that like, I will. Yeah. Anything is possible at this point. There is a lot unexplained things in this show, well, and I, I think this 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 show deals with a lot of metaphors and, and faith. Of faith, and, and that's like, all we already abstract. Why are you watching this? Yeah. Is there a possibility that Ruby will never return okay, here? Makes sense. Yeah. Because remember Ruby and Bjorn had their goodbye scene basically? Bjorn are inside. The end of everything. This is basically a re religious war. Yeah, but uh, uh, who's gonna win? People always say it's the Well, end. considering there is <laughs> Christianity is Exactly, but how is that gonna how is this, sh this entire show gonna finish right now? In really? I understand that we can fortify and be here and Whatever you hear the plan, the that's the thing that doesn't work. But we still have to accept that a large part of their army will what's manage what's to come short. What's what we hear Ivers plan? How are we to repel such a huge force? We'll see what sounds better. Summoned all his vassal kings in war. Not resign. Where's that? Where is it? Where is it? What? Losing. <laughs> Hopefully. I've committed myself to the destructive element. Tattoos? Do they exist before? I guess. Well, you technically can't fuck him even if you want to. Do you think you can? Well, she Maybe doesn't know that. Want to? See, if she was your ex wife, she would have known this. You are all for King Akon. Everyone else will vote for King Akon. They are Do you not think this is their war as well? Remember, like, end of last season, he was sitting and everyone around him was dead. Is that a foreshadow for this war? What do you want to say to me? Be my wife, be the wife. I would say to you what you already know. As I recognize something in you, you're ambitious. Literally, you've seen her. But you're in his tongue, I am married to the end. Does, does he not, yeah, has he not seen any other women in his life? Has this been? I guess you just has, What is wrong with him? Does he just want what Bjorn has? What? I don't get it. No, he just wants what he can't have. If you're truly a man. Oh my god, stop doing that. Tulu's gonna lose the baby. How far along is she? What is she expecting? Is she... Do you... 
ходиш і... Твоє собою. В курсі. Від ззаду. Я від ззаду. Я не знаю, що ти хочеш. Perhaps I am not meant to have a child with you. It's not the judgment of the gods. It's, it's you fucking pulling weights while you're pregnant. What is wrong with that, Alonji? Perhaps Ingrid will give you a son. You are the true king. You know that. Ingrid, I Do they know his little... You are the true king. ...right up front. front. Say no. Say no. Say no. Just shut up, don't even say anything. So you know I'm not King Harold is a troll king and we're gonna support him next in all his endeavors. I hope so. She told me that Prince Deer was alive and well. Thanks to you. No, you need to stay Thank away you from for being honest. No, she's not honest. I mean, I could see her not be happy, but I could see her betraying Fiverr as well. It's just... I think I'm falling in love with you. Yeah, that doesn't... I don't even know who you are. It doesn't mean much because you're falling in love with her because she reminds of her dead wife. Because she looks like her. In your mind. How are people falling in love with I don't know, they just keep so falling in with this show left and fucking right. Nothing happened and they're in love with each other. Right? They're stuck in my desk. What do you mean? And of course that's the thing that ruins all the plans. It's spring. Oh. Remember when Lagatha lost her child and the Ragnar and Mjord just sat with her? Remember that beautiful scene? Your Togatun and a few others have answered King Harold's summons. It is not enough. What a king he is. Several after the others. But don't do it in King Harold's name, do it in my name. Yes, they will come in your name. Don't you realize? What the fuck is wrong with him? And such things mean nothing now. Literally. So she like sitting in the corner of his room being like, I'm the king. It's me, not Bjorn. I'm the king. Let her go. Don't hurt her. This is it. Thrust. Are we actually seeing that in this episode? Not this bitch. There's literally not. We have like 50 people. Or remember when the rest of the army came to the dragon. I mean, they came over the hill, they were already there, but still. Well, let's hope today is your death. Let's hope you're in the States. It's more, it's more difficult. You know, Carl, and then they can all die here. It's where we will attack. Okay, we're here. Here is the mouth of the river leading into Arrow's capital. Yeah, but we're hearing it now. No doubt. Gun will block it. Which would make well as planning other surprises. That his plan works. The same as Bjorn Ironside. I certainly he'll be there. This is... Yes. I can assure you beyond any doubt that our brother will be there. What the fuck is that? That is not an army of people. There's like... 2,000 of them and there are like 50,000. If Loki appears like Gandalf over the hill with the Rohan army. Seems the gods brought us 
together on Jan my brother. I know better than to attack my own people with the Christian army. That's true. I like being on the winning side. And you also betray our father. Our father chose me of a boy. That is not true. He asked me first to go with him to worship. And then he has Vitsa, and then Sugar. It was only after we all refused that he turned to you. He knew? He knew that you would all refuse him. None of us wanted to accompany him on a journey to his death. We were more interested in preserving his legacy, which is what we have done. And I'll prove it. Bjorn. Bjorn said what I expected them. What are they doing? What I expected them to do. <laughs> What's going to happen? How is this acceptable? How is this acceptable? And when is it going to end? What is happening? Okay, what this, is, this is the end of season 5. Right now, because I feel like we're losing, and we need all the help we can get. But 
eventually fucking kill him. Oh, oh look at my bitch. He truly fights like Frollo. This is bad. I'm gonna come to his aid somehow. I don't know my dudes. I feel like we lost already. I have made many mistakes. Okay. I have failed. Okay. But this time I will not fail. abandoned you a long time ago, my brother. There's no way you can make me. Leave me. No way you can make me. I have no idea how to stop it ends. I don't think it ends good for you are on our side. Well, it can. Poss can possibly. Gather up the army, retreat, regroup, get the other people in here and defend the rest and then Who? get the hero. Get what people? There is no Well, the half man, no one showed up. No yeah, one showed up in the call of King Harold. Then Bjorn said, call them in my name. And those bitches better fucking show up. Find yourself another home. Find yourself another home. See, actually, my guy. Said Alfred. Yeah, I told you, Ivor, you can't kill him. It's impossible. It's a new world. How do you lose your mind from this to an end? Come with me, come to peace. We shall never surrender. 
if the Vikings is over. Vikings, the final episodes coming soon. On is there screen. another promo? Is there another thing? I don't think so. Go back. I think I saw something four days ago. Comic Con official clip. It's sleeping. We're gonna watch sleep peek. How is there a sneak peek to the episode? When is the episode? Labede, find it. Tutum, es to show. When is the episode? Tutum, es to show. Does it say something? Is it Lemon? What do you mean December? Literally, what the fuck do you mean by December? Okay. Bjorn got stabbed. But he is not dead. No, I don't think he's dead either. No, he just got fucking stabbed by Ivor. But, but who saves him? Um, yeah, and does Ivor know that he's not dead? I I don't think he knows. But it would be weird just like to stab your brother and turn your back and like not make sure that he's dead if you want him dead. Then yeah, but I don't. Know, so I mean, the war around them continues. Yeah, but like so. then you wait until the. And yeah, if to... they won, like they kill all of them, take them and like well, maybe, 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 body yeah, them. maybe, uh, maybe they're gonna be like, it would be... we never found the body, but like maybe because the army retreated, the Viking army retreated, and they would think they took Bjorn because like he was one of their leaders with them to give him a proper burial. Like mm -hmm. maybe it could be explained like that, why I ever thought he was yeah. dead. Because in the promo you see him saying something like he can be, or something. Like he's shocked at something. Uh, but, but that could be Alfred, or something. Maybe, or maybe, because he said you can't uh, win, defeat him. I told you you can't defeat him, that's what Pitsik yeah. told Ivar. Ivar. Uh, so maybe the armies, our armies are coming? When Ivar thought did they defeat all of them? I feel like this last two episodes while they were very slow in my opinion a lot has happened like so much i did not definitely expect this battle to happen now like i think what didn't we say at the beginning of this episode like that we didn't expect yeah like anything of significance because it, was, because it was one episode like and i mean yeah the battle can like happen in one episode but it didn't seem like it would honestly what the fucking happens in season six? Is is it gonna be? Because I, I always wanted to read that part of history, but I literally didn't want to read the <laughs> history that. because I don't want to be spoiled for the show, which sounds ridiculous. I mean, Scandinavia, whatever. It's predominantly Christian, right. and the religion doesn't exist. So I don't know when. Yeah, I don't know if they're gonna show that. In I don't know when or... that uh, when that transitioned. From the from the old Norse or whatever to Christianity, um, and I don't know if we're gonna see that. Like I don't know if it, this is already a, a losing battle. Yeah, I, you know I, I don't know if it, if we're gonna me. because like if this was not possibly loosely based on um, real events, I would assume that you know Bjorn would come back and win, and it's gonna you know stay. I mean he has to old come Norse. back. No, okay. No, I would. I don't. I. Uh, I. I don't think one brother is gonna like win him. I mean, we'll I see know, if every knows. single one of them is that. I don't think so. I don't think Ube. I don't. That's probably Ube's never gonna maybe come back. You know. Well, that's why the I asked in the middle of this episode. Uh, I asked like, what if Ube actually never comes yeah, back? Yeah, that would make sense because, because like, um, uh, he went to explore the lands. And we are on the losing side here. I really need um, Ube scene with Tiber. I, I would really want that. It. I don't think you're gonna get it. I think probably they're all gonna die, no? Except oh. even. I don't think one brother is gonna say a lot of like. I don't know. Maybe all of them. I have an idea. Okay, why are we we have now no idea what's gonna happen? Why are we even, like trying to figure out when we have no idea Apparently what the story is? Apparently Ube is also gonna be it's fighting a fucking gonna, war. Yeah, and we're gonna fight Egbert, so like, not Egbert, like Alfred. Alfred. That I liked. Uh, and I, I still fucking love, I, I, I love, I love the storyline with I still England. Love, I still love him, and uh, yeah, yeah, he has amazing story with uh, Ube. It would be a shame not to see that. Like, it would be a shame if Ube is only um, in Iceland. And like not connected to the rest of the storyline, just because I feel like there is such a, especially with his brothers, because if we're if we're talking about 
the brothers. I feel like out of all of them, Ube is the, you know, the most family-oriented person. I feel like he's the one that cares about brotherhood the most. Um, and uh, while well, the rest of them are literally killing each other. Yeah, but I feel like... And uh, so I feel like, uh, how do uh, they yeah, not... but it's not like... Uh, these storylines are gonna finish well. Like it's not like no, these I know it's not gonna, gonna finish, finish well. well. I just, I just feel like he it would have... be a shame to not have that, you know, final moment between them. Like however bad it is, or especially without whatever. our Nubin. Yeah, uh, but uh, yeah, I feel like maybe. Uh, uh, but I, 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 I actually wish for Ube to have a storyline of his own. No, I agree. I just. It's not I don't see him actually coming back. I think he's gonna have his happening. I, think I will take it. Yeah, I all think... my favorites have died. No, if he's I the one that like lives, deserves, I'll be fine. I, with I that. think he deserves to have his happy ending uh, on Iceland, and that would be like interesting part of history to also explore. I I don't know what I think about this last this last episode. I really enjoyed the kind of back and forth conversation never really happened uh, between uh, Ivor and Bjorn that we honestly, would just like saw them sitting on the beach and progressively see like dead bodies around them yeah I, w I honestly wish that conversation did happen uh, but it was like yeah but like in the middle idea. of the war where are they gonna yeah. sit you know it was I feel an like... interesting idea but I feel like it was so fast paced like it, no it wasn't like the episode wasn't that like fast paced but like so many happen, I don't know. I'm not sure if this is the last, if this is my favorite last episode. I mean, I know it definitely isn't. No, I enjoyed it. I've, I'm just left very confused by it. I think it's interesting uh, also the part about Ragnar and how they both have completely different views on Ragnar and what his legacy is and should be. No, that was my favorite part of the episode, the, the talk between them that again, never happened apparently. I was not ready for him to stab him. I just, it came out of nowhere. I don't like that. I don't not like that. I'm still processing. I don't like I need to I see the continuation. Like, uh, I, I, I kind of understand, but I don't like Ivor completely being on the... Um, like only wanting to be on the winning side and not caring that he just killed his brother. Like, I definitely did not expect this episode to finish like this, too. Like, I if Ivar was gonna stab him, but I expected it to be some different. I don't know. Is Harold dead? I mean, is anyone dead? I, I feel like he is also not dead, yeah, because I it feel also like feels his death, I mean, he's been with he's us for a long time, it feels anti-climatic if he's dead. Yeah, I agree. I don't even know who fucking I mean, killed like, him. hopefully, but I don't think I so. I don't mind him being dead, but, the, like, I, 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 I wished it was a, so. I don't know, more satisfying end. The whole thing feels like someone dreamed. Yeah, in my opinion. <laughs> it just feels like someone dreamed it up. That's why the they first thing I went with is, like is this uh, is this like a, a prophecy someone is coming up with? Is this like you know twilight breaking dawn when you see them all dying and then you see that it was just like Alice dreaming up of what might have been, what could be? I'm literally trying to understand this entire. But episode. it's not because we see in the promo for like, the next one I and it's like. Don't continuing. hate it. I didn't hate this entire episode. I just. I have no idea how I feel about anything. God, I hate that we watch this now. I wish we watched this in December. Well, Just no. because I would, I, 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 I feel like I want the answers now. I want to see the next episode. I just, I, I, I need that to crystallize this in my mind. Because I'm not sure what the fuck happened and then that mm -hmm. girl got raped. You should die. I don't know, it looks like, I, it looks What's to me like she was looking at water, so I thought she was gonna jump. And what about the fucking wife of Oleg? Who's now on, what, with Ivor, and wants to be with Ivor, and they like, didn't speak. Two sentences I to each other. I honestly have no idea. I, I, I really need to, like, I can't talk, but I don't know what, <laughs> I have no idea what I think, so like, I'm shocked. And surprised with this episode, definitely did not expect it. I did not expect like expect the battle. I did not oh, expect. Did not expect uh, I, I thought uh, the battle was gonna be. Ivor to to stab Bjorn. 
well at least not in that way <laughs> like yeah. it's not yeah, uncharacteristic not, yeah, that, there yeah definitely not in that way in that moment like so what is the C5-6B about? Imagine if Bernie is dead. <laughs> and, we and he to... died like that? No fucking way. Imagine. There's no fucking way. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, again, just... I feel like what I thought most this season was... I don't know how... What's his name? Alexander Lud Ludwig? Ludwig? Mm -hmm. Who plays Bjorn? How did he not get an Emmy? But also Travis never got an Emmy. I feel like he did, he does such a good job. Yeah, he was amazing, He does such like, a I don't good think job. I... This show doesn't just get him, I don't know what it is about. Or awards. And he doesn't get awards. Like, I don't know why. It's not, um... That's what I thought Like for the most of the season. I feel like he was just so good at it. Yeah, he was definitely... I was just his acting was definitely the highlight of the yeah. season. What do we think... If you ask me what I think of this season, I don't remember when <laughs> we watched the first half. Like a year ago. I don't remember what happened. The only thing My highlight, Ube. Highlight, no, highlight. My highlight was definitely Lyoth and her Aww. dance. The, uh, and the Bjorn and yeah, like the way good. he reacted. That was definitely the highlight of this episode. Yeah. Uh, this episode of season. the season. I definitely love that uh, Ube is left this tox toxic family behind him. And, le and, and went to explore and I hopefully that works nice I, I'm actually excited to see that hopefully it's gonna just I'm just hoping it's gonna be interesting more interesting than, than Loki's storyline yeah uh, that's the only thing like I I, I, I I have problems with like if if it doesn't have there that. Was, uh, there, they, there are already a lot of interesting elements there for me well yeah so I feel like it can be it could be good. Yeah, I like that we are following that kind of storyline uh, next to like this one with uh, Ivor and Bjorn and everything. Uh, what a lot of you are gonna disagree with me is that I I definitely don't am disappointed with uh, Ivor's storyline. Uh, I expected because like I I feel like since season four we we heard that Ivar is the one who goes to Russia and like is poor and I felt like it's gonna be a bigger I don't know more interesting part of the uh, story. The thing I, I think we skipped. I imagined it to be much uh, much more interesting. Uh, I, I feel like we skipped him. Like now he uh, like we said he does a much better job I think at controlling himself. And controlling yeah, himself. I love that. And I that feel like we skipped that part uh, um, from the time jump from when he started going to Russia to when he actually came to Russia. I feel like uh, we didn't see how he became I don't know that way we just saw him you know being more calm in the beginning we didn't even know like if he just to us looked like Confused. surprised about everything like not paying attention which was so weird for us um and then you realize that he was paying attention he was planning and that's like in his character uh but I feel like there's a part that we skipped there, yeah, that is a part of development that, that I think I wish I would have seen. Something, more. something uh, is missing there, in my opinion. Yeah. Uh, and uh, I mean, technically, I like this. I like this storyline for, for his character. I I like the where his character went, but I don't like the process of it. Like how? Yeah, and I also I don't think. I think the whole thing with uh, him seeing his ex-wife and all that i just i don't know i mean it's not my favorite part him. like it's haunting him no, but I, I feel like i i don't uh nothing there is like my favorite i don't like anything mm. uh, about like his being in russia and like the storyline with all like he's boring to me he's quite uh, getting on my nerves nothing there is interesting even this kid yeah, I like I, I feel like, like someone's uh, like yeah. people say like uh like you can see Iris development because like he cares about the, the kid, but I feel like you know the kid is insane, uh, and there are parts when Iris looked at him like yeah that kid is insane, but I like also I don't know why I wouldn't agree with him because Iris also cruel, um, but to me it didn't feel like. Maybe now it does, but like it never, it never it feels. Bit, yeah, now it does a bit, but like it never felt to me like oh he cares about the kid. I was it, he, it more feels like he's grooming him. Yeah. So that yeah, he can you know yeah, take over. Yeah. It never felt like he cared. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I just and like I feel like if they wanted to portray it like that, and maybe they do. I feel like it should have been done in a different way. <laughs> exactly. Like the way the entire storyline was done, I don't like. Yeah, I feel like they could have. I don't know. Maybe gave the boy a storyline that Ivor could connect with. 
connect with. Yeah. Uh, but I don't see that storyline for him. Uh, either is the only thing that connects him is either telling him that uh, the boy owns everything and should own mm-hmm. everything and everything's that of himself as well. Yeah. I mean, there's like God complexes there. I think that's the only thing that connects them. Yeah. Um, I feel for Ivor's character, the thing that made me feel the most is now his with Fitzgerald relationship Definitely. that like happened in the past episode. Definitely. Um, I think that was like the most I like that, that I felt there. Yeah, yeah. I like. Yeah, well, we talked about that in the previous. Yeah. Episode. <laughs> well, that's pretty oh, much no. uh, into what I address, what I think about uh, this season right now. What did everyone else think of this? Can anyone tell us? I'm curious to know what everyone thought of this when it aired. Tell us what you think. If you think Gorm's dead, I hope you don't think that. (laughs) There's no way he's dead. Imagine this being his death. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, We'll we'll, we'll see you in December. December 4th. Or 5th. This time we're gonna film week by week. Unless... No, we end up in quarantine. In December, I don't think we're we're gonna be... I don't know when the second wave is supposed to hit. Uh, Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye.